What is up, YouTube? It is your boy Jad here from Poopa Plow playing some more Farming Simulator 22. We are back on Alma, Missouri. Let's get to it. Hello? No. Hey, Tony, you get it fixed? No. Sure it's still like flashing black at you. I don't know. I'm just using my second monitor as a main one now. So. And it's working? He literally just left. Tony. Here's your answer, John. <laughs> Tony, you good? <laughs> I Okay. My second monitor is an old TV and, like, a little bit, like, I can't see the top of it and, and like, oh, cut off. Yeah. So I was trying to minimize it, but I hit the X button. I can't really see. I can't see them. Uh-huh. Okay. So, uh, so I have two things I want to. I'm. It's it's um. Uh, show and tell today on uh, Puma Plow. Okay. Okay. You ready for this, Tony? Do you have stream pulled up or no? Tony, go first. Tony probably can't actually have stream pulled up. Can you? <laughs> Hold on. I got to tab out. Yeah, I'm here. <laughs> All right. So uh, uh, look at look at old Tony. Look at look at Tony chat. Just just happy as can be. In the same blue shirt. <laughs> I own more than one shirt. <laughs> uh, so anyway, this is from Sunday. Tony came to the farm and we got the tractor out. We did some uh, did some plowing. So there, there's Tony, isn't he? Just he's just look at he's just he's just so happy. Look at that. Or are you sneezing? Is that what that is? Actually, I don't know. I don't. Know. I'm not oh. sure. Wow, look at that dent in that hood, though. Oh. That's almost as big as Timmy's, you know, head dent. Damn. Anyway, so I thought that was cool. Um, that is cool. I like. And that. then, and then there's, and then there's this one. That just. Are you kidding me right now? You know, come on. Play your desktop. No, not yet. No, I just got these on the computer today. So oh, anyway, those new tires. I'm Aren't they beauty? The Aren't they? The front and back are, are all new. Yeah. Aren't those tires beautiful? They're very, very not cheap. <laughs> and and fun fact, when Zach's on the tractor, this one's spinning out the whole time <laughs> when he's plowing. So anyway, that's all I get. So back to farming. Bear 0313 cheered Dex 100. That young man better not be vaping. Better not be vaping. Wait, Zach, are you vaping, bro? No, I'm not vaping. Are you... <laughs> You look like you could be having like a sneeze attack. I'm not sure. I don't really don't know what what's happening. Uh, you're just living your best life, Bear. Thanks for the uh, thanks for the hundred bits and what's going on. I'm in shambles, actually, quite honestly. Plugger, you have bigger tires that would prevent slipping. What? Bitch. Bet you do. Yeah, off the tractor pull tractor, right? Yeah. So I uh, got to come clean with y'all a little bit here. I might have sold bales. Hence why we have $1.5 million. <laughs> now, I didn't sell any of the whatever color that is, teal. Uh, because they uh they're not ready yet. They're still they're still grass. LSWs? Oh man. This is so trippy. What? I'm looking to my right to play farm soon. <laughs> Not about it, huh? I, I thought you got it switched up that uh, tech support. He did, and Tony. then it stopped working, right? I just think I'm going to buy new monitors, I think. Today? Sure. <laughs> I get paid. Dead, so when do I get paid? I... Uh, anyway, so I sold a bunch of bales. I actually sold a bunch of the silage bales out of storage because I just don't hate them. So anyway, I'm going to hit the button. Please, thank you. I don't know if I need LSWs or just like if I sit on the tractor, it's fine. Like I don't, it doesn't spin out when I sit there. You know, need it, it more traction. You know what I mean? I'm sure a wider tire would help. Yes, but you can't have too big of a tire, at least on the right side, because you're down in the furrow. You know, put duels on it. Put duels on it. You know, I always laugh at like the tractors with with like one duel on the back on the left side. Yeah, because when you're plowing, it's not even down in the furrow anyway, or it's not it's not even touching the ground. So it's kind of funny. 
Um, there's an 8400 on sale or 8000 series. Do we need that? Why I was not? I was talking about more tractors, but I don't know if I need any more green ones. And Left's not here to tell me to buy it, so. It is a good looking tractor. It is, but we have so many green ones already, you know? And not everybody is a fan of green tractors, so. I like tractors just in general. <laughs> Cody23 just resubscribed oh, for seven yeah. months. Cody, what's going on, man? Thanks for the seven month resub. CFO approved. Oh man, the approval came in a little too late. I just said Left's not here and he just joined TeamSpeak. Oof. Uh, Oof. He's, he's been in and out, I think. Has he? Okay. Too much green is hard on the eyes. Exactly. Plugger, you know what? I was actually thinking about buying something on here. And I think it would make you very happy. I was thinking about it. In the million dollar case tractor. We don't need that much horsepower for anything. Uh, Tony, let's go another day because, like, you know, there's snow on the ground and stuff, and it, it just annoys me. Uh, although okay. we need to feed our cows first, probably, don't we? Yeah, to the, to the cow barn. To the cow barn. You betcha. And, Tony, you like tractors, huh? I, I yes, I do like tractors. I couldn't, I couldn't tell, actually. Couldn't, couldn't tell, Tony. I mean, look at that. A profile <laughs> picture? Hello. I'll send it to you. <laughs> Swap a tractor for the 84. Well, you know. Wait for that, huh? But I was thinking about buying something. And Plugger at least would like it more than the green tractors. It's not his little Massey, because I don't have that mod on here. But... It might be a Massey. Right. Tractor sounds good. Which one you got? The uh, tricycle. Yeah, I'll probably have to come like rescue you. Just uh, yeah. give me a jiffy awesome. here. Okay. You want to spawn some bales out of those buildings? We need uh, hay and silage. We don't need straw. How many you want me to spawn? I uh, like 25 of each this way. Or 24, 25, whatever. Uh, kind of farm boy, yeah, kind of. I'm just trying to make it so our little uh, tractors can make it into the barn. That's all I'm trying to do. And we got to rescue the tractor because it might be stuck right now. Oh, did you just fall into the... <laughs> Hold on. Pizza, what's up, by the way? Sorry. How's it going? Okay, I hit you the wrong way. Okay, you're good. All right. Yes, sir. Um, I haven't been around for like this this whole like cow yeah. process. So, uh, so actually, first thing is if you go and empty it because it still has some TMR in it. Okay. Um, or you can just click start on auto drive and it'll do its thing. Should be all set up for it. What we? Oh no, actually, hang on a minute. Oh well. Well, I gotta clear the snow first. <laughs> Otherwise, it won't work. But basically, it's two silage and one A. Uh, okay. But you need the thing to be empty first. So two silage, one A, and then the rest. Nothing. Just two silage, one A. Yep. The snow's just disappearing. It is disappearing. It's magic. Except for that might cause issues. Where that? Yeah. Look at Tony, he's gonna use the loader, guys. Oh man. The snow's so bad I can't even see the auto jack lines. Good gosh. Well they're kinda there sometimes. It's crazy. That's one thing about this map, man, when it snows, it snows. It is insane. Yeah, we're just magic snow blowing right now, just to get rid of it. Yeah, I bet you. If we had bigger tractors on the mix wagons, it would be fine, but I don't really see a purpose in having like large horsepower on a mixing wagon when you don't really need that. 
Oh, yeah. So, Chad, who's ready for some captain of industry tomorrow? I was playing it yesterday, getting ready. Familiarizing myself with the game a little bit. I know things are going to change tomorrow with that update, but... That'd be pretty awesome. Hates this here part. All right, so, Tony, basically where he's at right now, he'll come around and park here. Okay. Um, and then you can pull him up with two and one. Or if you want, you can cheat and use a uh, lumberjack and just pick up the whales too. But, uh, oh, actually hit the little arrow, double arrow to tell him to go around. Not bad. Is that one empty? No. Uh, sure is not. Oh, okay. It will be momentarily though, don't worry. Never fear. Empty mixing wagons are near. That was good, right? Sure. Um, I just have heard that he's on his road to recovery. That's all I've heard from, boy. Which one is Captain of Industry? It's the one with all the excavating and moving of the, the dirt and stuff, Justin. Speaking of that, John... Oh, no. Not Fruity Pebbles. Took me a minute, Justin. It's not Fruity Pebbles. Fruity Pebbles is Automation Empire. What's up, Trent? Sorry. Did it, did it get to that limestone? Yeah. Yeah. I might have to turn out a, uh, a hill. <laughs> did it get yeah. Or to make a ten block bridge? Nice. Oh, nice. I can't get to uh, any of this because it's on a trigger point. I always get the suit. And... Yeah, it's the one with all the like mining and and digging and stuff, Justin. That's uh, that's what it is. Say, so, Tony, which side do you want me to clear more of? Uh, I'll go on this on the uh, the right side over here. Yeah, I clear all that out for you. Thank you. Make life a little bit easier. Oh, uh, this is very specifically for Tony, but Tony, I got the right app today. Oh yeah, I, I told you I had the right app, right? Uh, but I like, I like open the app with the camera in my hand, right? Uh huh. Or this. Do you have your bail spike out right now? Hit X. Yeah, it's going in. Oh, okay. If you. Okay, it should just fall in once you uh, remove the grapple. Oh, hit X to get rid of your bail spike. There you go. Yeah, you don't need the spike technically. But anyway, I got the right app, right? Uh huh. And uh, boy, it instantly recognized the camera, and it's like, oh, you want to update your firm firmware? Sweet, let's like let's make it happen, buddy. Come on. That's cool. So I got that updated and. Uh, we're good to go. Oh, yeah. And, uh, oh, and I got a faster SD card for it, so it doesn't complain about that anymore. That's awesome. I did. Professional, you know? Almost like, you know. Almost like I knew what I was doing. Yeah. I didn't. Yes. Don't worry. <laughs> oh, and John, you, you won't guess how like, me and Tom stayed in. Uh, probably pretty late. Right? Uh, five, five o'clock. You were playing Captain of Industry till five, Trent? Yeah. <laughs> Yo, Trent's a pro gamer, Chad. Pro gamer. Didn't wake up till 15 till noon. Ah, uh, GG's, bro. GG's. Hold to you. <laughs> Hey, I was up at like 10 o'clock today. I don't want to hear it. 10.30, maybe? Tony, what time did you get up today? Uh, I don't know if I set my alarm or if I did and I turned it off, but I think Dad woke me up somewhere around like 5.30. That's up a.m.? Is that... Okay. Yeah. Normally, like, I would say, I think most of the time I set my alarm for like 5. Well... Uh, Sean. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's right. Sean's got that big storm going on. Sean, I'm sorry to hear you lost power. That sucks, man. 
Yeah. That tractor. Do what? I was gonna say I want to get his power back. Yeah. That tractor needs fuel. It does. I just noticed that. Yeah. I didn't notice it. Yeah. It definitely needs fuel. We'll go grab some fuel for it. Uh, Tony, if you get bored, these guys over here, the sheep, uh, there's a round feeder over here. Uh, okay. they, they take hay bales. Okay. So, and, and you don't have to put them in the thing. You can put it next to it. But yeah. If you, if you get to it. Not a big deal. All right, let's go grab some petrol. Because uh, we're about to run out. Oh, and that's good. And then I'm going to look at the tractor that I might be buying tonight. Because a telehandler works over there. But there's just something about a tractor. I want a tractor. I don't want a telehandler over there. And speaking of telehandlers, I'm st we're still leasing that one. We need to get rid of that. And the grapple for it. And that wrapper as well. But we got to buy something. Because we have money. We have lots of money. Not worried about our finances right now on this map. I know we need to buy land and we need to buy combines, but quality of life comes first, right? We'll just we'll just snow blow our way where we're going. It's gonna be faster. Just random path, don't mind me. Oh man. And then we're on the repair point. We can't use it anyway. So we have all these tractors, right? And uh, we have two 49s, or what are these? Not 49.60s, 47.55. Got two of those. We got, the, you know, there's. Problem is, you can't put a front loader on like any of the tractors that we have. We can put a track one on the 78.10, but. Other cow pen. Are you going to buy the, the one up the, up the road, right? You may buy this farm? I mean, I could. You know, it's less than 300,000. We definitely could. But for this operation here, what I'm really thinking about, let's, let's figure this out, chat. What I'm really thinking about is, is it's not in this category, huh? It's only a medium tractor, really? That's interesting. Okay, I was thinking about, I think, yes, so the big Massey, is this not the right one, 280 horsepower, I feel like that's not the right one, that's not the big one, I guess it is the big one, that's what I was thinking about, it was the biggest, uh, the biggest Massey, I thought it had 300 horsepower, wait, yes. wait, wait, there is one with 300 horsepower. That's weird. That's weird. But anyway, I was thinking about a Massey. Throw a weight on the back, front loader arms on the front. John, right. that's too new for you. Trent, we have an 8R on the farm. Oh, <laughs> uh, can't go wrong with a Massey. And then we put, you know... Wheel weights on the back to help weight it down a little bit. We don't need... I mean, we can put GPS on here, but we're never going to use it. It's a... You know. It's only $260,000. Fine. We have money, right? <laughs> Something like that. Well, we had money. How many you need to make us some money, dog? Okay. Get right on that, right? I didn't realize we had case arms, so, so I guess we got to use like. Hmm. What like did this. you get? The quickie or the? Is there a different on that tractor? The arms. You can get different arms for it. I just got the one. 
Oh, there. Yeah. Okay. Hold on. So I got. Okay. Okay. I didn't realize that. I thought it was just front loader arms. Yes or no? Ah. <laughs> All right. So we want these bad boys right here. All right. We're gonna buy those. And then we want that same bale grapple or this bale wrapper apple. Probably just get the same one and be done with it. Um, so yeah. Oh, this is where I get yelled at. Oh, it's Sarge. He's not going to yell at me. Okay. Sarge, what's up? Oh, not much. <laughs> I thought you were going to be left and yelling at me for not buying a tractor earlier. Uh, he's still on the road. Oh, is he on the road? I think he's still on the road. 2.5. What's the heaviest weight? 3.3? Three, three? Need the heaviest weight. I don't care about the brand. We're gonna buy, We're about to put a fat weight on the back of that thing. But we can make it massy red. That's the case. Look at that. Oh, man. You betcha. So hopefully this tractor has enough weight to be able to load bales better and stuff. And it's not articulated like the, uh, the wheel loader that Tony's messing with right now. Because that's fun, right, Tony? It ain't, it's ain't terrible, I guess. It'd be easier to do in real life. Yeah. Wait. Yeah. I don't know way, but yeah, a little easier. Put it on the list, Tony. Oh, Tony, guess what? Guess what Pops did today? What did he do? Without mentioning, you know, but he went to the uh, reunion today. Reunion? For the farm. Huh? The farm reunion that they hold every year. For the little town down by the farm. I, you don't know about this? I'm lost. <laughs> So I don't even know how many years ago this this group of old timers, uh, people that grew up down by the farm, yeah, they started having like a lunch once a year, and they call it the you know town reunion. That's cool. And uh, we've been invited to it for several years, so they just like mail out a thing, right? Uh -huh. Well, for some reason this year they had my name on it, which I thought was weird. Because, no, I don't know anybody down there, right? Necessarily. But, uh, yeah, so Pops wasn't going to go. And then today he's like, yeah, I'm going to go up there and have lunch with, with them. And I was like, all right, have fun. That's he, cool. He was gone for like five hours. Good for him. There were 75 people there. Oh, my goodness. I know. It was crazy. So he got to talk to people he hasn't talked to in, you know, 40 years. That's awesome. Is, yeah, get to meet some people he's never met. Yeah, it's kind of interesting. So, he had a great time. So, in a, in a way, I kind of wish I would have gone, but at the same time, like, I wouldn't have known anybody there, so. Like, your one cousin, I, w I would know him. Like, the seed salesman guy. Uh-huh. But that's about it. Oh. Hey, uh, for the record, record, this tractor does not like snow. You know, blade on the front of this thing. It just, you know, cleared up. I know who does like messing with snow in this game, though. That'd be Sarge. <laughs> right? Yep. We don't have a snow blade. We have a snow blower. I, ah, a, all good. I just cleared a little around where the... Uh, the cow barn so that those little old tractors could drive because spoiler shocker surprise we're feeding cows because that's a surprise to no one right and ray wants us to buy the other cow barn too i don't, I don't know about that ray we need more cows man be kind of interesting 
Kind of interesting. All right, tell me what you got going on here. Yes, on mixers. Thanks for the follow. Appreciate you. Welcome in. How's it going? Babin. Oh, you're doing it that way, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I don't blame you. You feed the uh, sheep. I am not. All right, I'll, get, I'll handle that. We'll use the new tractor to feed the sheep, you know? <laughs> yeah, that that loader's fine. It's just being articulated. It's kind of awkward sometimes. Uh, it ain't bad. It's just I feel like I can do it a lot faster, especially. Oh, Jeff, that's not fun. That's not fun at all, Jeff. I mean, I've never done that in a semi truck because I've never driven a semi, but, and, and yeah. Yeah. That's not fun, Jeff. Okay, so six bales. Um, still maybe a little light on the, but, it, but the back end's on the ground. I'm happy with that. I like it. Right. Yeah. Yeah, this is going to be uh, better, especially when we have to load like the semi truck with uh, with all the bales if we're if we're selling bales with that. Cause I, I did load the semi truck a little bit with uh, silage bales the other night on here. Tuesday night it was, but like golly, it took forever, and I could only I could only move like three bales at a time with uh, with the thingy doofer, the telehandler. So it was not fun. Not fun. Don't you touch my bales, honey boo boo. Are you going to that mixer now? I'll go to the next one since you already put stuff in it. So go ahead and fill up the one you got. It's just, you know, I bought the tractor to. I have to use it at least a little bit, right? Almost fell over right there. Did y'all see that? <laughs> Almost got sleepy. It's the snow. The snow is not helping. You got your three bales in there? Uh, yes, sir. All right. Right, all right. So I got the next one. All right. Assuming he'll be driving out here in a second. I don't think. Yeah, they're, well, they're 200,000. They hold three, so. We're getting there. Although, actually, no, yeah, we want to go another day. Okay. Just one more. One more day. It's kind of handy having them on auto drive, isn't it, Zach? Yes, it is. Because you don't have to constantly jump in them and move them, and you just let them do their thing. And he'll stop up here somewhere, I swear. <laughs> somewhere, there he goes. Okay, got it. Got it, got it. Come on. Go. It's definitely a lot more work feeding like this, so. Just throwing that out there compared to just chucking bales. It's so much easier to chuck them. After I grab these two, you want to spawn some more? Yeah. Or wait. Wait, no. Oh. no. I got it. I, I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. They were so perfect. Whoa. Hold on. Like nothing ever happened. Like nothing ever. Ha yeah, okay. Or something. Something like that, yeah. Oh, jeepers. Oh, hey, uh, Tony. Like nothing ever happened. <laughs> like nothing ever happened. 
Perfect. <laughs> you know that never happens though. Never happened. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah, they should be getting full here soon. Ish. <laughs> soon ish. If the snow wasn't here, life would be a little bit better. That's all right. We'll make do. Unfortunately, with those triggers here, you can't get rid of all the snow. See, now you're doing it. You're pre-stacking for me over there, huh? You bet. Okay. Oh, well. that. Oh. <laughs> Oops. Tony, where'd your bail go? Right here. Magic. Erased from existence. Oh, man. I get this neck out there for you. Hang on. Problem is that snow is like making me go uphill. Tis a tis a little awkward. Just a little. Oh, Zach! Zach, dad was surprised to see everybody's favorite uh, father was there. Everybody's favorite person's dad was there. Gotcha. Yeah. I thought it was kind of interesting. There's a nice slaughterhouse coming out. Interesting. Interesting. Can you imagine the day they actually, like, you know, put a slaughterhouse in the game? Oh, wait, that'll never happen. It will never happen. You gotta drop the bales from a from a height. That way they're tenderized. Tenderized on the way down, you see. There or something like that. Alright, while we're in the groove here, let's fast time another day and then we can feed them till they're full. And go work on fields. Because they're they were pretty full. Pretty full. Come on. So, Tony, your your one monitor is working now, right? Mm hmm The other one's just, what, off? Uh, it's not. Oh, I can't even turn the power button. I, I don't know. I just unplugged it. Okay. You unplugged it? I unplugged it from the back of the machine, so. Oh, boy. Well, I guess yeah. I need to go buy a different monitor. can't have anything nice, huh? Yeah, I guess. Hate when that happens. Just like it was weird though, just like quit working. Probably because it ran farm sim for like three weeks, you know? Yeah, probably. 24 7, no breaks. I could have been like our thunderstorm we had the other day, or who knows? A lot of potential reasons. Right. I was like, why is there one bale? It's silent. Oh, wait, we're out of bales here? Oh. Okay, BRB. Guess I gotta go get some bales, huh? Good thing I happen to know where a few, few bales are. Uh, I just, wait, hang on. Where are our bale trailers at? Probably in the field now. Wait, 
wait, where are our belt? Wait. Aha. That's what it is. They were still on auto drive from the other day. But apparently, I have a hay bale. Okay. All right, so these bales uh, should definitely be ready by now. They should be fine to go back to the homestead there. That's a quality. Yeah. Quality. Only the best. Only the best. Come on. How's that tractor handle the snow there, Zach? Uh, I guess decent. It's the four-wheel drive. Or something. I don't know. I guess better than... Not just too bad. Okay. A little, uh... Snow's a little real right now. It's like halfway up my tires on my trailer. Or at least it's into the rim. Can't have anything nice, chat. All right, and by the way, so wait, Sarge, do you still see snow? Yes, I do. Are we all getting the snow glitch, I wonder? Or does it, this, it should be melted because we got to go do field work and that's not going to, we'll have to use to have tools to get rid of it. Kind of cool that the snow affects the tractors. Yeah, yeah. Yep, that's why if you have to do like a bunch of trucking or something like that in the winter, you better uh, you better get out and clear your roads. It's just snow plow or snow blower or something and clear the path at least a little bit. Although some of the roads like don't build up with snow. Some do, some don't. Oh, yeah. Mud mod. You know, I have never messed with that mud mod. Heard a lot about it, but I've never messed with it. Maybe someday. Maybe someday we'll have dynamic ground. And then you don't need a mud mod because that's just the way it is, right? Maybe someday. Are we finally out of extra straw bales, Sarge? What? We're out of extra straw bales finally? Ones that were around the side, yeah. Oh, uh, good. Good, good, good. Tony, it looks like you are struggle busting, my dude. We're making it. You watch somebody bury their wow. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, right plugger, right? The farming's going. Welcome in. Tap. I got another little nasty. Or maybe this is the one you're talking about, Plugger. This one out here. Pretty much only use it for bail wrapping. That's the only job it does anymore is bail wrap. One of our tractors we started the farm with. So, I guess we'll keep it till we're done. It'll have a forever home, you know. Dang it, stack. Purdy, please. Thank you. Nope. We're not stacking Purdy. Now it's all messed up. It's all junk now, chat. I just want a Purdy stack of bales. That's all I want. Oh, with the weight loader. Yeah, I, I just bought that one, Plugger. That's what I was, I was saying before, that I was going to buy something you might like. 
I know it's not your Massey, but still Massey nonetheless. Oh well, it was pretty. Okay, good enough. We got it. We got a full load. That's what really matters here. The snow is causing chaos out here, and I kind of want to like just get rid of it with Dev Tools, but like the struggle is, you know, it's it's fun. Oh, got you, plugger. Yeah, I paid full price for it and everything. Uh, the reason for it is it, it's a heavier, and it doesn't like, the back end doesn't come off the ground with uh, three, four, actually six bales. I moved six hay bales with it. The back end didn't come off the ground, so that's what we're going to use for uh, feeding. When I feel like feeding with a tractor and not with, uh, you know, lumberjack. Sorry, Serge. All good. Almost did it again. I'm going to sneak behind you here. Oh, let me just sneak right past you, huh, Tom? That was my fault. Just uh, kind of close quarters here, my, my a little, little bit. If you just want to park that tractor, I'll uh, run you some more bales and you can start feeding again, Tony. Okay. Because uh, I think this tractor might handle the snow a little better than the... Just tad. Your 7810. Although the more we drive on it, the worse it gets, so... That's kind of fun, too. It's like snow runner up in here all of a sudden, you know. Need to lock this thing down and like first gear lock the differential and be done with it, right? Or something like that. Arch got a silage bale in there. Oh, Wait, somebody there. put one in there. Oh, is that what it was? <laughs> Get the chains out, yeah, right? Pretty much. That's pretty much what we need right now, yeah. It was probably me, sorry, let's be honest. Hang on, Tony, I got you, don't spawn. I got you. Thank you. Okay, bye. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Bear, what's going on? What's up? How much? Hey there. Hello. For the record, I was glad I wasn't taking a drink when I opened that Instagram for you today. <laughs> I was good. I was thinking. I was debating whether my first words coming in here was going to be anybody want a cucumber? <laughs> no. <laughs> nope. Yeah. Um, I don't know what my algorithm is so that that <laughs> popped up, but, and, but I was like, I've seen that guy a few times actually. Okay. And he does like different contraptions with different vegetables. And okay. I was like, "What? What is this?" And I'm like, "Oh, John, John would find this hilariously disturbing." It was yeah. Your algorithm is something different. Is it's built different? Yeah. Definitely. That's all we're gonna say. Mm -hmm. I saw a great TikTok today. I should have posted it in the uh, TikTok channel. They, it was people that had like a spider filter. And they would like, hey, look at my phone real quick and like hand their phone to somebody else. Or like, hey, look at this. I'm going to film a TikTok real quick. Like, look at the phone, you know? And mm -hmm. so it like puts a spider on these people's face and they're all smacking themselves in the face and stuff. <laughs> Trying to get rid of this giant spider. It was hilarious. It always yeah. embarrasses you after a tech, uh, tech talk. Tech, tech talk? Yeah, with Tony earlier. Oh, yeah, we fixed, well, kind of fixed it, but then it broke anyway. So, yeah. Tony had oh, to go. Tony, Tony had to go live in Discord on his phone to show us what he was doing. Good time. It was a good time. Was, I was laughing. We were all laughing. So the only time that that Tony shows up is mm -hmm. when he needs help. Got it. Yep. There, there it is. You know, fun fact: Tony's actually been here two <clears throat> nights in a row now. What? He was in here last night for a little bit. Yeah. You know what? I retract my last statement. Yeah. Kind of wild. So Sorry if I knocked it out of your hand, search. The, well, he the, still needed help. But. No, the funny thing was the last night, I happened to look at TeamSpeak and I saw Tony's name in AFK and then it disappeared right away. And I was like, oh, that's weird. He just like joined and left. 
So I was getting ready to hop up to the top channel anyway and talk to Trent and uh, Tom was up there. And so I jump up and I was like, oh, did you guys see Tony was here? And he's like, yeah, he's gone. And I happened to look over at the farm sim like panel thing for the server and it said Tony joined. And I was like, what's he doing in there? So I literally <laughs> stopped what I was doing, joined farm sim just to bother him. <laughs> but yeah, it was funny. Then we had a good little chat, right? Or something like yeah. that. Yeah. yeah. So, how's, the, how's, the, how's the job going, Tony? Not too bad. Uh, not just has it. It's, I saw uh, you broke something the other day. Wait, what Tony break? Tony breaks something. You're going to have to be more specific. <laughs> <laughs> so he's like, I break Wait, a lot of things. Wasn't it like a control arm or a, or a tie rod or something? Broke a mirror. Oh, well, not oh here, on the though. on the John Deere, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, I broke uh broke the radio antenna off. Oh no! I guess that's okay for you because you're probably just listening to your phone all day. So you're not listening to the radio, right? Yeah, but then so like Monday I was spreading and I couldn't get my aux cord I couldn't get my aux cord to work, so I'm listening to the radio. That thing doesn't have Bluetooth, my guy. No. Really? No, it's a uh, 14 model, I think. Oh. Okay. Well, yeah, but you can still like get the uh, radio installed that has Bluetooth that enabled. Yeah, but it's not his machine, so uh, there is a random straw bale in this. Um, I don't know why or where it came from. <laughs> All right. It was just He's making it someone else's problem. Uh, pretty much, yeah. 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 So I sold like uh, like six hundred thousand dollars of bales the other night. So. That's pretty good, right? Or something like that. A lot of money. Yeah, yeah. Not gonna lie, I kind of wish we had a plow truck on here, <laughs> right now. We don't know how to plow. There's no, we don't have a modded plow truck. I didn't bring any of those mods from uh, my lanes. We had all the plow trucks on there. Uh, thanks for that follow. Appreciate you. Welcome in. How's it going? What's happening? What is happening? What? I was just saying, answer your question. But it works going pretty good. How's your work going? Interesting. He, he hates being back at it. You're still employed, uh, right? So. Yes. Yes, I am. That's good. As far as I know, my paycheck clears tomorrow. So we're <laughs> <okay>. <laughs> at least you. We'll, hope. See, we'll see at midnight. Oh man. <clears throat> That's. Yeah. So actually, I. Uh, you know, like, on your Snapchat, you get, like, Snapchat memories from, like, you know, whatever you save, like, from yeah. this day, so many years ago. Oh. Like, it just goes back. I know you're a big, you're a big Snapchat memory guy. So it's today. Who up there? What? No, I'm sorry. Leonard, what's up? Welcome in. Bestie! Okay, all right. All right. That was a little extra. <laughs> I should see, I'm not friends with Leonard on Instagram. Really? He would appreciate what you sent me. Yeah, he, he would have loved... I think he would have loved that video. <laughs> he's got that He's got that kind of sense of humor. In fairness, I didn't know I was friends with you on Instagram for like six months, so... Well, you know. <clears throat> it happens, right? Mm -hmm. Like, I don't know who this guy is, but he sends me some out, like, some off the wall. Stuff. Way, way out. Uh, but it's okay. It happens. Leonard, what's up? What happened? Hi, Leonard. I was going to say, I'd, we kind of talked about it earlier with Yulberry. Yulberry watched it. I didn't because I thought it was tomorrow, but opening day was today, Zach. For the yeah. Cardinals. I actually won. I thought it was tomorrow. I got to go watch it now, tonight, like after, you know, at least, it, not like the whole game, but like the before pregame stuff. Yeah. It's like a holiday here in St. Louis, you know. I think I saw they uh, they booed Mosaic when he came out. Not surprised. Must uh, not surprised. that be uh, that big of a holiday if you didn't watch it. Well, it's a holiday for the people that take off work and like you know go to downtown and like go to opening day and spend all the rest of the day at the bars and stuff. You know, I don't I don't do any of that. So. Yeah. 
So how was the bar, Tony? <laughs> uh, I don't know. I, went, I was went to work and then uh, I didn't even go to the bar for lunch. I went to Italian, so I don't, I don't know. Bam. Or Sicilian, I believe. What the rest Sicilian. Is. Wow. Yeah, that lasagna is pretty buzzing. All right. That's my story. I'm sticking to it, I suppose. Hey, uh, hey, Bear. You got you got stream up? Yeah. yeah. Did you see how happy Tony was? Here we go. Same shirt. I already hear it coming. I already hear it coming. I already hear it coming. Bear, look how happy he is. Look at look at him. Look at Tony. He's so happy. Anyway. Yeah, it, it's great that you pay attention to to chat because I was the one that said that. Oh, you it were. Like he was vaping. You're right. Yeah. <laughs> I just wanted to show it again. I believe he even like cheered. Oh yeah, you were the one that. Yeah. Jeez. It's okay. It's all right. You got a lot going on. You know, playing your video games and talking to people. I, I do. I have a lot on my mind too. Other stuff. Mm -hmm. Sure. Yeah. I, no, literally, I was workshopping video ideas with Dad today. All right. Ooh. Sure, just an old bear. Oh, I was. There's a video that I filmed years ago, and with newer technology and better cameras and stuff, I want to refilm the same video, basically. Um, and Pops and I were talking about it today. So. You know, sitting here thinking about like logistically how to make that happen, you know? So, all good. It's all good. Because I loaded like a whole bunch of files into an editing program today and it kind of gave me like flashbacks, but in a good way of like actually editing like non video game content, you know? Yeah. Little yeah. diversification. Yeah, yeah. Like drone footage. And yeah. Oh, breaking out the old old drones? I mean it's actually sitting like three feet right behind me right now. Is yours right. still covered in dust, John? No, it's not I keep it in a case. I have a giant oh. Is your case still covered in dust? Maybe uh, like mine? Well, actually it's not really dust, <laughs> it's more like farm dirt. Because it gets dirty at the farm. Um, but I have a giant. The case that I have is like a one of those. I guess you call it like a pelican. I think a pelican's a brand though, right? But it's like black plastic with the foam inside. And then I've got like yeah. my, my drone and two cameras and mounts. And I have a selfie stick in there, you know. Uh, battery chargers and extra batteries and extra memory cards and any cable I could need and a microphone if I need it and like the whole the whole smorgasbord is inside this case. And fun fact, I actually kind of threw it across my garage today and didn't like mean to. So I tried to move it and then I kind of dropped it and it went flying. But everything's okay because it's all in foam and it's meant to be like beat up. But it's like waterproof. If I could go throw it in the creek if I wanted to, you know? I'm not going to, but I could. So, I think it was a Sam's Club find, actually. It was, yeah. We had a Sam's Club, like, years ago. And it's kind of like, just like a big, like, briefcase thing. Right? Tony, I don't know. How would you describe it? Yeah, it's like a... Just yeah. Big, a big case. Yeah. Here you go. But it holds everything. It's awesome. It's one one and done. Which I really uh, appreciate that. Are the cows? The cows are full, huh? Yes, sir. Well, that's yep, good, they are. good timing to be done hauling bales, huh? All right, so we're allegedly going to plant, but, like, uh, we're going to have to get rid of the snow. And then we're just going to have to deal with the, uh, the, the, the frost glitch. Um, Frosty. Unfortunately, just want to roll time a little bit, or just I use dev tools. It'll it'll disappear <clears throat> in a second. This map's kind of weird, so yeah, we'll just uh, everything will be frosty now instead of snow on the ground, right? Oh, all good. Uh, I guess we need to decide what we're planting, right? You have pelican cases for luggage. Oh, that's a good idea. They're built, man. They're really built. Mm-hmm. They're rugged. 
And mine's an off brand. <laughs> so. Yeah, I do like yeah, the drone field. case too. Yeah. Do what, Sarge? Out. Uh, field supplant. I was kind of thinking about maybe we go do corn over in 3132 because that has been manured. And if we do that, it'll help with the nitrogen. Oh, I didn't even see. Yeah. Yeah, you caught me with that the other day. What's that? <laughs> you sneaking in field 31 oh. and 32 and on us. Corn down there? Yeah. And then actually, if you're, uh, these planters have liquid tanks. If we top up the liquid, um, then we'll just be done. So it'll, it'll take care of the fertilizer for us and, uh, we'll see it as well. But yeah, we'll just do that. Planting in the frost. Man, this is, this map's weird when it comes to winter. I don't know why. Hopefully it's part of the update too. Whenever that comes out. Has there been any, any additional rumblings or rumors about the next game? I hate to be one of those guys, but... Oh, there's always rumors, yeah. Yeah, just nothing. I haven't seen anything official yet, so... And... I mean... I wouldn't be the first one to know when there is something official. Let's, you know... <laughs> Let's be honest here, right? Right. So, because you know they're not gonna, they're not gonna be like, "Hey, John." So, yeah. Adam is gone, man. How you doing? I did see a trailer for a game on TikTok, and I don't remember the name of the game. That's the first strike here, but I did look it up on my Steam. I should have added it to my wish list. It looks kind of cool. It's a survival game and it looks like it's only going to be single player which kind of sucks but it's a survival game and the scenario that you have to survive is you're on a cargo ship like a container ship so you have to go around the ship and open containers where where do we grab the liquid for uh the buy everything station behind the uh silo or the grain bin the west of the grain bins. Uh, but it's a survival cargo ship game, if that makes any sense at all. You're just on like a cargo ship and you have to like survive. And it, it looks kind of interesting. I don't know if there's like a set number of days or I don't know what the. I don't know about any of that. But it looks kind of interesting. Now, it might be one of those games where it looked cool in the trailer, but, like, you never know. But I did see, like, open a container of, like, dirt bikes. So I guess you can, like, ride a dirt bike around. I don't know. It looked kind of, uh, interesting. Oh, yeah. You never know. And I guess technically our... Hell your hay might be ready to make, but we don't really need to worry about that right now. So it's all good. Good. Speaking of cases for things, Trent, do you still have that case that I gave you when I sold you my drone? My old drone? Oh yeah. I keep it in it. That thing was bulky. That uh -huh. case. Well the drone's bulky too, but the case, my goodness. I think it was a chunk. What sucked about that is okay, I can't get it to switch over to fur. Can't get it. Uh, are there IBC toads laying around over there? Oh, you know what? That's what it is. Hold on. Hang on. I forgot about this. Uh, here we go. I'll bring the sprayer. I'll get you some toads. Him. I forgot this this is how it had to be. Mine was full, so I just like hooked it. Here tones, let me get in here. Excuse me. Pardon me. Yep. 
there. Help off those bad boys. There we go. That should be enough. This right now. Thank you. Nothing like a IBC tote spawner, you know? Did you just empty that sprayer? Is that how you did that? Yeah. Nice. That's almost as good as a mob spawner in uh, Minecraft right there, right? Uh, the old one hit with the sword, you know? Yeah, gotta love it. Although, let's be honest, the best one was where I had it set up. So the... The uh, skeletons would uh, automatically get killed by a pack of wolves on a spawner. That was cool. You day of K tonight, come back the next day to have like 40, 50 levels just sitting there. And you didn't have to do anything at all. That was pretty fun back in the day. Was a good time. I will tell y'all I'm you know, I'm chewing through the fertilizer pretty good on this, so. But right. So this had slurry on it uh, the other day, which there's not that much of, so that's good. Right. Oh, Tony, Tony, remember I told you Sunday I was going to buy something for dad for his birthday. Did you buy it? It should be here tomorrow. <laughs> Pulled the trigger, huh? The old TikTok uh, ads got me. I didn't buy it through TikTok, though. I bought it from Amazon. Well, you bought one of the things. Oh, I bought the thing for, for Pops' birthdays coming up, so. I bought him uh, an airbag jack. They've been all over my For You page on TikTok lately. And uh, it seems pretty slick, honestly. And if nothing else, it's a whole lot lighter than a regular floor jack and you know I don't know if anybody's tried to roll a floor jack through uh, a dirt floor building it's not fun so we'll try this thing out see if we uh, see if we like it I think it's going to be, uh, be good I hope The old, what do you get somebody that has everything they could, you know, either buy him shelving or another tool that he doesn't have, which is kind of rare to find. Because usually Pops is the person, if he wants something, he'll just go buy it. It might be the Harbor Freight version of whatever, but he's going to buy it, you know. So Pops is very hard to shop for when it comes to Christmas or birthdays or whatever. Yeah, mom was very difficult to shop for too. Although usually just, you just buy her wooden spoon, she was happy. Right, are you guys on GPS or no over there? No. Not yet. Okay. I can uh, grab this switch pass. Oh yeah, that's fine. I got a double end row done down here, so. Oh, okay. This should be good though. Back and forth. After that, I, mean, we, I guess we can put more. Well, no, you guys did enroll, so yeah, we're good to go. Back and forth, then. We should go over and plant a little bit of corn in the grass fields, too. For that, uh... oh, what's it called? For the weeds. That's what we should do before we're uh, done planting corn. Been meaning to do, to do that for a couple days, and I keep forgetting about it. Don't you got no force fire there? I think so. <laughs> I know so. I would definitely hope so. But that's all right. 
Yeah, fertilizer use is, is uh, kind of high, isn't it? Yeah. Maybe should have put uh, double rate uh, liquid down instead of a single rate. I keep forgetting that's a, an option. You just push a button. You have the, the Solari applicator. That's all right, though. Although I think if I did double, we wouldn't have actually had enough to do this field. So, oh good. These uh, frosty weeds are kind of weird. We must have some good seed treatment on here to you know, keep our seed good in these cold conditions. Or something. I mean, it says it's 23 right now, so. I don't know about this. So at some point, after looking at some footage today, I will have a video of plowing from uh, Sunday. I throw in some other footage too from, from a previous plowing adventure. I gotta find that stuff. That's on my phone yet, I think. But don't worry, you won't notice because Tony's wearing the same shirt in both, both clips, so it'll look like the same day, right? Sure. I definitely have to include some of that because I have I have video of Dad Blau, so we had to put him in the video too. I might have video of my brother. I don't remember if I got a video of him running the tractor or not. Not sure. I don't remember. Logger Bear, what's going on, man? We're doing. How are you? We're doing. Oh man. Uh, I don't use Starlink, but we do have a Starlink user among us. Uh, which is Mr. Uh, Mr. Trent. Trent, what's your thoughts on Starlink? If you don't mind, give us a little bit. I don't it's know. better than what I had. Yeah. So, I mean, what are your speeds here, like, on average? What do you think your speeds are? Do you know? I don't look at it uh, that often. <laughs> so, Trent lives out in the country, and... His internet before was very terrible. A little bit, little bit. L3 FT 43 Atch Eardex 100. Hey John, what do you call an old snowman? A glass of water. Wow. Laugh, thanks for the bits. Do you appreciate it? Yes, I heard those crickets. One seventy five down, twenty to thirty twenty five to thirty up. Peter Peter has one too, loves it. So I would say, I mean, it's an it's a viable option. You're not gonna get like, you know, gig speed, which obviously it's not what it's designed for, right? The big thing with Starlink is for people like say Trent, where he lived out in the middle of nowhere and his internet used to cut out like every three and a half minutes, you know? And it and when he did have internet it was it was so slow, it was you know, it was crazy. Um, I mean, I don't know what kind of issues you're having with your cable company. You're thinking about dumping them, but, uh, kind of interesting. That's at peak time too. That's not bad at peak time. That's not bad at all. But yeah, I, uh, I have thought about it as like a, well, back when I was with Spectrum internet still, I thought about it as like a backup. So I have Spectrum and then have. Uh, Starlink at that time there was still a waiting list for Starlink and all that stuff. So hey. 
Yeah, Starlink definitely does not like trees. We could ask our buddy Tom about that. Wow. Since the storms last Monday, you're still without. Holy cow. Interesting. Yeah, that's definitely not good to still be without uh, internet since the storms Monday. Not good. Hope that gets, gets resolved. Yeah, right? Hopefully. Hopefully. Does this have to be unfolded to fill here? Yeah. All right. But yeah, I mean, from what I've heard, the people that have been in this chat that have it, they all love it. Um, of course, a lot of the people that I've talked to with it, like, are out in the boonies, you know? <laughs> like, out in the country where there really isn't another option. So, yeah. Power came up yesterday. You're a little south of me. Oh, you're down. Okay. Yeah, southern Missouri got hit pretty good. Uh, the other day. Southern Missouri definitely got hit pretty good. I was watching, uh, watching it on radar. <laughs> oh, man. Zero other options for what exactly? Yep. Ingrainer Codex just subscribed. Ah, uh, thanks for that subscription. I guess he didn't like the ads, huh? Did you get the same Six Flags ad? Because Ingrain Codex, I appreciate it. Thank you. I'm really tired of seeing that that Six Flags ad on on uh, Twitch. Just throwing that out there. So tired of that same ad. I don't mind ads. I just don't buy. I don't like the same ad. You know, give me some different ads. I'm not buying the Six Flags, you know, year pass or whatever, you know. Still got ads. I'll be able to refresh and get rid of those ads. But he can't hear me, so. Uh, if he refreshes, he'd be fine. That's funny. That's funny. You barely have cell booster. Or barely have cell. Holy cow. That's not good. So yeah, Starlink is like life changing then, huh? That's crazy. That is crazy. Right. Refresh the stream. Wow. Wow. Um. But yeah, Starlink definitely has its place. I mean, I like in my situation that I'm in now, where I have fiber internet. Literally, fiber goes all the way into my house. I, there's no reason for me to ever get Starlink. You know. Um. But if that's your only option, or if that's the best option, then heck yeah, go for it. You ever seen the Six Flags ad? I don't even think it's for like Six Flags St. Louis. It's for like a like a Six Flags resort or something. And I'm like, I'm not I, I don't even know where it's at. I'm not gonna go to it first off. Like, come on now. Kinda weird, but yeah. Kinda weird. Tony, you're uh you're so much faster than I am. <laughs> I'm just, just, just cruising. Oh, Tony, come back. Where are you going? Why are you so much faster than me? I, I don't know. Tony, your cedar's supposed to be in the ground. Uh, it, oh, oh. He's so much faster, Chad. Jeez. So much faster. Golly.
Uh, no problem, and uh, thanks for the sub as well. Thanks for that sub, now that you can actually hear me. <laughs> Couldn't hear me before. Oh, yeah. Uh, last time I had never heard that song, no. Oh, sorry, Sarge. I didn't realize you were back. I thought you were still getting seed. I'll buy it. The last farmer, no. No I'm, worries. I never heard that before. I did listen to it, though. I clicked on it. I was like, what the heck is this? What in the grass mowing redneck is this? I'm here for it. That's the song I should put on my Instagram story when I... There you go. When I'm mowing grass next time at the farm. You can see the video now. Speaking of videos from the farm. It's amazing when you have the DJI camera and you have the right DJI app. You can download the videos right from the camera to your phone. That's cool. And let, like doesn't take long at all. It's amazing. I did that today. I didn't even put the SD card in the computer from the that camera. So yeah. Knew it was all me. <laughs> so yeah, I thought that was pretty cool. Yeah, come to find out, Tony, the, the right app is not on like app stores. You have to download it from their website. Oh. Yeah, it's kind of weird. I don't know. I don't know. Very strange, though. But, yeah. Thanks to whoever finished my pass. It makes your drone so much easier. What's that, Justin? Being able to just put stuff right onto your phone? Because I can do that. I just didn't know about it till like, t today. So, yeah. Didn't know about it. That's all right. It it happens, right? Because in theory, if I'm like filming stuff at the farm, then before I leave the farm, I should take a minute and transfer everything to my phone. That way, when I get home, all my data is with me on my phone, and I don't have to worry about like, oh, where's that SD card? Your DJ and my app. Maybe it's different on Apple, Leonard. I don't know. I don't know. And then the interesting thing is, so, so, or Leonard, what's your app called that you're using on your drone? Do you know? Or on your, that you have, Leonard? You just found the song in Discord and you went to high school at that singer. No way. <laughs> That's great. That's great. That's funny. Because I've downloaded several DJI apps, but none of them... See, that app crashes on my phone, Leonard. I go to open it, and it immediately closes. I have it. It just closes all the time. I used to use that one to fly. And then I downloaded this other one, which is not even from DJI. So I'm actually going to uninstall that one. Wait, so you don't fly your drone through the DJI Go 4 app? The Go 4 app crashes on my phone. So how, do you how do you fly your drone? Uh, some other app that I downloaded that controlled it. Oh, some other DJI app, but it's not actually from DJI. Yeah, that oh, Go okay. the Go 4 app just crashes all the time. Huh. Well, yeah, I don't know. It's like, it's... It's weird. Yeah. DJI Fly. That's the app that I had that I was using the other day, but I don't think that's actually from DJI, is it? It might be. I don't know. That's the one I was using the other day, uh, Justin. But I think this this Mimo app or whatever. Yeah. That's that's the one that you download from the from like the their website. And that one I think will do like any other stuff. I thought that was the only download that, did, that was just basically like a, a store. No, that was the DJI Shop app that we downloaded. I had to search this Mimo app. I, I found it on through a YouTube video. And the guy's like, yeah, once you download the Mimo app. And I was like, what's that? 
Hold on, now I gotta download that. So, yeah, I don't know, I'm not, man. I'm not planting it low. I don't know, I just I just work here, you know? Just part-time. <laughs> At best, yeah. At best. <laughs> Part time at best, my boy. So I don't know. I basically I, I got the app. It works with the action cam that I have from DJI, and and I was happy. So, that's the more moral of the story today. I was happy with how it worked. And I'm not gonna lie. I'm kind of tempted to get one of their their pocket. Uh, uh, what's it called? Cameras. Oh yeah, but I don't know if I'm going to do that or not. And if you get the new pocket camera that they have, or the newest one, the DJI microphones can sync right up to it, and you don't have to worry about the stupid little, uh, like, receiver thing that you have to plug into your phone or whatever. And you can film in vertical on there, so if you're going to, like, put something on TikTok or Instagram right away, you can just do that. So I've been I've been kind of I've been kind of looking. So just in the looking phase, though. I'm not like actually pulling the trigger on anything right now. Just looking, you know. Because I'm just thinking, I'm thinking like some buttery smooth like farm show footage this summer, Zach. You know what I mean? Um, you're, we're back to filming the farm show. Maybe just a little bit, not like super like a lot. Maybe just a little, you know. Don't you enjoy just, like, enjoying it, though? That was last year I, for me. I didn't film, like, nothing. But there's there, there's a way there's a way to do both, you know? Yeah, yeah. And maybe it's just, like, you know, so like, more like, like pulling your phone out, not, like, getting, like, the whole, like, shebang out. Yeah, but, not like, trying this, to, yeah. This yeah. could be, like, yeah, I, I, I get that. Yeah. But, you know, maybe with, like, higher quality than just a phone, you know? Yeah. A little bit. Not that phones are bad these days, let's be honest. You playing anything else? Or? Uh, well, we've got all these other fields we can do something with. Um, we have wheat. Um, we could plant oat if we wanted to. We could plant more corn. We could plant sunflowers. We never plant sunflowers. Um, we could plant some peas again for some cash. We could do that. I'm cool with that. I don't, we don't really, I don't care what we, you know, don't really care what we plant. Uh, production wise, we could use, uh, we need to go move dry corn eventually. Uh, we can plant oats for uh, flour and sell that, which we've been doing. We can plant sorghum for flour as well. Is it time for sorghum by chance? Sorghum. Sorghum. We can. Let's plant some <clears throat> sorghum. We never plant sorghum. All right. Let's go plant some Milo. And it's the... No, Zach. It's called sorghum. Look at it. It says it down there. Yeah, Milo. I'm looking <laughs> right at it. <laughs> oh, you got the Milo convert ad? Or convert mod? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> you want to plant that and everything, or...? Uh, let's put, let's put Sorghum, I mean Milo, in, uh, one. Sor... Sor, sor Milo? Sor Milo, eh, it's got a bad ring to it. Yeah, it does I'll have plant a bad some ring. Sorghum. Sorghum? Plant some Sorghum. Alright, let's go. Although, fertilizer, I don't know, how much fertilizer does Sorghum use? I don't actually know. It's cooking pretty good, or... If we run out really fast, we'll just leave it out, and then we'll fertilize later. We'll break out the, uh, something else to fertilize later. That's fine. Looks like it's got about the same, same clip as like, what corn was. Oh, okay. That's not bad, then. Um, and then... GPS, we can just hot rotate, right? Yeah, bet. Sorghum. Oh yeah, 